So good morning, children and young people. Um, parents, invite your children and young people to the screen. Um, we're going to share a moment just for them. Um, and, and we're grateful for, so grateful for our young people in our community. Um, I just want to let you know you're really, really important to us um, during this time. So we really care about you and love you. So Pastor Susan chose a beautiful quote from C.S. Lewis, and I just want to take um, one phrase out of that that I think you as young people and children will really understand. And it says, the world is crowded with God. The world is crowded with God. And as I think about that, I think about this world that you see to my right, really crowded with the presence of God, that God is in all things, that God is in everything, um, and that God's presence is just alive. And I want to share a few places um, that I find God. If God is crowded in our world and walks um, in our world and among us, I think God is, is really in so many different places and spaces. So I know Jackson oftentimes kind of does what I guess is called video bombing, and he just kind of walks into the picture. Um, and this is a place that I find God. I very much find God in Jackson because he gives me comfort, he gives me peace, um, he wags his tail whenever he sees me, and it reminds me that I bring delight to God. Another place that I find God, and I found God, was when my Auntie Anne was alive, and I've talked about her before, Auntie Annabelle. Um, she was very much the presence of God in my life. She showed love. Um, she showed me love when sometimes I didn't feel love from a, a lot of the rest of my family members. I also find God in art and in paintings, and in very particular in this one. This is actually um, the Madonna and Jesus. It's Mary and Jesus, and I find such um, love and compassion in this image, and it reminds me of God's love and compassion of me. And this was given to me by Sabrina, a friend of mine who's a painter, and it's kind of an icon, like an Orthodox um, Greek-Russian um, format for the art. And another place I find God is in this art, which is, of course, Jackson, but Keith Dallenbach gave this to me simply as a gift. And I really find God's presence in this because it was created and it was painted in love. And then Grace noticed this beautiful geode that appeared on my desk in my office, um, and I still don't know who gave me the geode. But I think I find God in this incredibly earthy, beautiful piece of rock and stone and earth, and how many thousands of years it took to really create this beautiful geode. And so I think, think about where you find the presence of God, or where you feel your life is really crowded with the presence of God. And last but not least, I have a mirror. And I just want you to come close and look into the mirror and realize that you are also the presence of God. Each one of you, each of you young people, children, um, the people that are out there worshiping online, we're all filled with God. And we are the very presence of God to one another. Um, so as you look in the mirror, um, this morning or this afternoon or tomorrow morning. Just think about how God is in you and the whole world is simply crowded with the presence of God through all of the people, the animals, the creation, the geodes, that God's presence is everywhere, everywhere and the world is crowded with God. So thank you for joining me. Um, we look forward to being back together again so that we can be face-to-face -face when it's safe. Thank you.